Hi everybody, welcome back. So in today's video, I have a full day of eating for you guys. Um, it's morning. Um, I don't know if you can tell outside, but the sun hasn't actually risen fully yet. Um, I like to wake up pretty early um, before my kiddos do and just get a few things done. And first of all, I what I like to do is eat. I wake up, I am hungry. I do not wake up and do things for a couple hours. I get up and I cook myself some breakfast and enjoy that breakfast. So this morning, um, what I have here is I have two eggs and I cut up an apple and I am finishing up our peanut butter, um, but it wasn't enough for me. So I went ahead and I added some almond butter um, to that because I know I'm going to want some more um, nut butter than just that little bit. And then, um, of course, I have a delicious cup of coffee here. Um, and that's it that's what i'm having for my breakfast and i am going to go ahead and enjoy this and i will see you guys at lunchtime so i just thought i would share this my hardest thing about like a healthy routine of eating and that is drinking my water i don't know why but i I'm not a water girl, but I know how healthy it is and I know that we need water. That's one of the number one ways that our body detoxifies and it's just important to have in a healthy diet. So um, I just, how I make sure that I'm drinking enough water is I just take water with me in a couple different spots. So after breakfast, um, after I've done a couple things, a lot of times I'll, before my kids wake up, especially my littlest one, um, I will like to go out on a walk and just get some fresh air. And I bring my glass of water with me. Um, when I take my kids to school, um, I bring my glass of water with me and I try to drink it before, like I'll try to drink this glass um, while I'm out here walking or like if I take my kids to school, then I try to have my water done by the time I get back home. Um, that's what works for me to get my water in because literally I could just go all day and not drink anything besides coffee and not even realize it. So um, yeah, I'm just going to go here and enjoy my walk, drink my water um, until my littlest one wakes up. I might have five minutes. I might have an hour. We will see. Um, but it's a little tip. Hopefully it helps you. If you guys have tips for drinking water, let me know because, man, I don't know why I hate drinking water. <laughs> I'm starving and I am so happy that it is lunchtime and I am about ready to eat all of this deliciousness right here. So I have two chicken sausages here. I'll show you um, the brand, I guess. But this is um, the chicken sausages. These are really good um, and they have really good ingredients. So I am not a calorie counting girl and I am not a macro girl. What I am is I am an ingredient girl. If I can look at a package of something and I can read every single ingredient in it, um, my body knows what to do with that food. But if I look at a package and I can't read half the ingredients or I don't know what they are and I have to Google them and look them up, then it's a pass for me. Um, so I'm gonna enjoy these delicious chicken sausages. Um, with this spicy mustard here. Um, this is really good. And these chicken sausages are sweet. They have like pineapple and apple in them. And I love the combination of the sweet with the spicy. It's delicious. But um, I also just have some bell pepper and some cucumbers and some carrots here. Um, and I have a banana here and I just sprinkled some cinnamon on it. Um, cinnamon is a really good anti-inflammatory and it tastes amazing. It makes that banana even taste better than what a banana is. And so it's a win-win. And um, the other type of girl that I am is I am a keep your blood stable, blood sugar stable girl. Try to say that, that's a tongue twister. 
blood sugar stable girl. <laughs> um, but if I was just to have this banana on its own, I would grab a hard boiled egg. I would grab um, a piece of lunch meat. Um, I'd put some nut spread on that. Um, even my kids, I, my 14 year old and my six year old, they know that if they ask for a snack, um, like if they ask for this banana, they know, they'll say, and I can have a hard boiled egg with it, or I can have some almond butter with it, because they know how to keep their blood sugar stable. And that is when you're gonna feel your best. You are gonna feel your best when your blood shape blood sugar is just stable when it's not having these big spikes and drops. Um, so I am going to sit down and I am going to enjoy this and I will see you guys um, probably at snack time. So, so it's been a couple hours and I'm ready for a snack. Um, I actually almost forgot to uh, put this part in and then um, I started kind of eating it. You'll see it's like broken, but um, and I was like, oh, I got to film this. Um, but anyways, um, this is what I'm having for a snack today. So oops. these are the granola bars that I um, made a couple of days ago. These are delicious. I actually filmed them. Um, so if you haven't seen them, go check it out because these are so good and they are full of fat and protein and fiber this is going to keep me full until dinner time and of course i have to have my afternoon cup of coffee so um, i am going to go and enjoy, eat this um, and enjoy this and um, finish up what I have to do um, and figure out what I'm going to make because I don't even know what I'm going to make yet and dinner is in a couple hours <laughs> so I got to figure that out <laughs> um, but I will see you in a couple more hours. <laughs> It's dinner time and I figured out what to make. It's just a very simple dinner that we're having tonight, nothing special. Um, all I did, I just roasted up a couple um, chicken legs. I um, just put them in a bowl and put some olive oil and a whole bunch of spices. Um, Ignore that, that's my husband who needs to come to dinner um, while the food is hot, but he is a workaholic and he's working on our deck right now. Um, but anyways, um, I just put some spices on those and just oven roasted them. Um, and um, the same time that those were roasting, I just threw some sweet potatoes in the oven and so um, we're just having like baked sweet potatoes. I put a couple, well, probably like a tablespoon of butter on those. Um, you always want to, um, with your vegetables, especially like, um, like this has a lot of vitamin A, which is a fat soluble vitamin. You always want to add a fat to your vegetables. It helps your body to absorb all the vitamins from the vegetables better. That's why like we put dressings on salads and things like that. Um, it helps our bodies when we give them both of those things at the same time. It helps them pull all of those vitamins out of there. So anyways, and then we just have a salad. Um, it's just like a green salad. It's got a whole bunch of different um, types of lettuce and spinach and things in it. And I just put some green onion on it. And then um, I just made a homemade dressing. Um, I always make a homemade dressing. It's super simple it's just like um olive oil and then however like if i use like four tablespoons of olive oil i put two um tablespoons of whatever type of vinegar um this one has a red wine vinegar um and then i just put um like a teaspoon maybe two teaspoons of honey in there and then i just put um onion powder, salt, pepper, oregano, just to taste. I just keep tasting it until I like it. So that's it. That's what we're having for dinner tonight. And I am not a snacker after dinner. Um, usually after dinner, I'm full and I am full the rest of the night. And I just, it's probably why I wake up so hungry the next day. Um, Cause it's usually a pretty like a 12 hour span until I wake up and eat breakfast the next day. 
So that's it. That's what I eat in a day. And um, I'm going to go and enjoy this dinner, make my husband come in, eat some dinner with the family. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video.